guys, this is Roxy B and today I have an unboxing of a Chanel product. Let's start! This packaging is absolutely beautiful with the Chanel ribbon and the lovely white camellia flower. There we go. That was simple. Ta-da! Yay! So, these are receipts. This is from the Chanel store. And this is basically the same thing in a different format. I got this item on March 4th, 2021. And this is just from FedEx. You know, just in case I wanted to return it. There we go. Oh! I tell you one thing. This was not easy. I've been after this product since December 2020. So this is a card that the people from the Chanel um, store sent me. And I bought this on 57th Street in New York. And this is very pretty. Chanel Karl Lagerfeld, of course. I love Karl Lagerfeld as well. And Chanel, dear. Roxy B. Thank you for your patience as we experience shipment delays of our iconic Chanel boxes. We hope you're enjoying your Chanel handbag. Oh, now you know what it is. And look forward to seeing you in the boutique soon. All the best, your friends at Chanel 57th Street. And that's it. That's a nice touch, right? Put this back and continue. I haven't had a Chanel before, and the reason why I haven't really paid attention much to the Chanel bags before is because nothing really called my attention that much, that much for me to purchase. But this time is different. So, this is the bag right in here. This beautiful Chanel 19 flat bag, it is a classic bag. It is in black, as you all can see. The quilting is gigantic. It's very um, squishy and puffy, soft, extremely soft, which I absolutely love. This beautiful Chanel 19 made out of lambskin, it has a top handle and also, if we open it, we can get out the strap that allows us to wear the bag crossbody or on the shoulder. This trendy CC is one of the most prominent parts of the bag. Let's get this out of the way. There, it has this little plastic that we don't need anymore. Okay. This is for protection, but I just want to talk to you a little bit about this part. The logo stand out a lot, especially because my bag is in black. This woven logo and the metal in gold is located right in the center of the bag. So there is nothing that is competing with it. This is a gorgeous logo and I'm all for the logo in this bag absolutely all for the logo on the other side we have a back pocket and the back pocket is easily reachable it is in color red inside with fabric and we have these are tags for the um, bag again this is the back pocket Oh, and the great thing is there is big, you know, it goes all the way from side to side and it's big and you can fit there your phone and other things. So we close with a magnetic closure. The Chanel 19 has four different sizes. The first one is a belt bag. 
The second one is this one, the flap bag. And from the bags, this will be the smallest size. Then we have a large bag and then a maxi bag. For me, this is the best size because it is a bag with a size very practical. I can fit a lot of stuff in here. Look at the sides, you know, so you can really fit a lot of stuff in there. And it's just perfect for my needs. The Chanel 19 also comes with a top handle and a strap. The top handle is in gold color and the strap comes in three different metals. The gold tone, the silver tone, which is this one, and the ruthenium finished metal, which is in black. That is the way it goes. And one thing that I really, really love, among many other things, about this bag is that the strap also has this part in leather that will sit on top of your shoulder and it will make carrying this bag a lot more comfortable. We'll open the bag through the CC um, knob. There is right in the middle of the CC logo. And we can see that it brings some papers to fill it up. Inside of the bag, we can see there is um, fabric in red, a very rich red that I really like. And it has also, right here, it has this metal um, plate that it says Chanel made in Italy. And then this zipper for a side um, pocket. And here we have the authenticity card, which I'm not gonna, you know, cover that. But you know, close. The zipper has Chanel written in letters right here. And that's how the inside of the bag looks like. It also has this little tab that has some numbers in the bag. The bag is very unstructured, so there is not real structure here. It's very squishy and puffy and soft very very soft the finish is shiny as you guys can appreciate and absolutely i'm all for that as well and i really think that this bag brings fresh air to the chanel brand a curious detail about the bag is that the chanel 19 was the last uh, bag designed by Karl lagerfeld for chanel this bag was also released on um, 2019 that's why it's called Chanel 19 the Chanel 19 also comes in many different colors and materials like leather and wool tweed fabrics the style is really very fresh and young and I am all for that because this bag is very unstructured it really looks like a pillow feels like a pillow too I got for it an organizer that is gonna help me if I want to give it a little bit more structure and the brand for the organizer is Zumoni I chose the red one you can choose any color you like they have many different colors because I wanted to go with kind of like the red that I have here. They're not exactly the same red, but it's fine. I don't have a problem with that. And it has a few compartments. Let's see what we have right here. This Chanel 19 brings a care instruction package which I already opened, but I'm gonna share with you. It has this little Chanel um, fabric. It's like a flannel. It's very soft, like the kind of things that you use to clean shoes. And 
you just put your hands like this inside and you proceed to clean your bag just like that and that's how they um, recommend that we maintain our bags and what else do we have in here i guess that this will be explaining how you need to care for the bag and that's exactly what it is the instruction care comes in different languages and that's it and that's it for now guys i hope you enjoyed the unboxing this is my newest bag is the chanel 19 and i am gonna have to name it i like to name things i don't know what name i'm gonna give it to this little baby but if you guys have any ideas please post it down there in the comment section what name should i give to this beautiful chanel 19 i will appreciate very much your help see you in the next one bye bye